Hello, this is Marlith Austin. I'm a transition counselor with Fleet and Family Support Center. A transition counselor provides employment and transition assistance to service members and their families. In this video, another transition counselor and I will provide a condensed version of one of the many helpful workshops that we provide at Fleet and Family Support Hi everyone, I'm Emily Snowden, a transition counselor over at Fleet and Family Support Center, and we're gonna be talking about resumes today. Writing a resume is much more than displaying your top qualities and skills. A resume allows you to make your first point of contact with an employer. You only have one opportunity to make a great and positive first impression. Writing a resume also allows the employer to have a better understanding about your strengths, skills, and experience. A master resume captures your full employment history, along with showing any qualifications, training, certifications that you may have. Keep, make sure to keep it chronological having your current employment and from there listing your jobs in descending order by date. You can utilize your evaluations in VMET to help refresh your memory on your job accomplishments. When you have a master resume, this will help you create a targeted resume or a federal resume within the federal sector. There are important rules to keep in mind of what not to do when writing a resume. First of all, do not plagiarize any words on a job description. Instead, use a thesaurus for synonyms or paraphrase the required qualifications. Also, do not use personal information. You shouldn't put any personal information next to your name that you wouldn't want to share with the public. Lastly, do not use misspelling words or grammatical errors. If you're unsure about misspellings or grammatical errors, contact us here at Fleet and Family Support Center. We are always happy to help. There are many resume styles out there. For example, there's chronological, functional, and combination. And today we're gonna to be focusing in on chronological resumes. A chronological resume is widely used and easy to read due to the flow of descending work experience. A chronological resume also allows you to highlight your responsibilities and your growth. It's best to use if you have steady work experience and you should always list your current employment first. In our Career Services Office over at Fleet and Family Support Center, we're able to help you with any sort of resume format understanding more about what federal resumes look like, along with any sort of interviewing skills, resume tips, we're here to help you. We hope you enjoyed our video on resume writing. We look forward to seeing you at our next workshop. Thank you and have a great day.